Okay, hi, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am watching episode four of Bakuten or Backflip. Um, and we are continuing into their training camp. I guess like training camp arc. The last episode we got introduced to I guess one of their one of our team's rivals. I believe it's called the school is called Shiro Shiro High. Um that did rec try to recruit um Misato, but obviously Misato didn't go to them. Um and I don't know if like well, so far, what's been shown is that, yeah, they're rivals, but they're also, like, relatively friendly toward each other. There's not intense rivalries. Um, so it's nice that we get to see, like, the these interactions between, you know, our main characters and our supporting cast from the other schools. And we had the return of my absolute sunshine, my absolute favorite. He is... <laughs> I am so biased towards um, Mashiro. Like, I love Shotaro, don't get me wrong. He is also a sunshine, but Mashiro is just... He had my heart, honestly. In that the first episode, in that one scene, he already grabbed my heart. And he's not letting go, so... We're gonna continue on with the training camp arc. Um, and... We ended off last episode with like a very spectacular performance by our Shiro, Shiro High team. I'm guessing because of that um, performance, our boys are going to be feeling kind of intimidated. So we will see the development in this episode. Without further ado, let's get started. They're back in their dorms. I love that, you know, they live together. I absolutely love that they all live together. Well, except for Misato. That was a performance. Wow. Oh no, even their captain feels intimidated. They will get there. He definitely is a standout, like, even just his character design. Oh, they're all, they're all staying in the dorms. <laughs> oh my god. Oh wait, never mind. He just snuck in there. Oh wait, are they actually staying in the dorms with them? Futachi. Oh, Misafon. Does he miss me so far? I knew it. <laughs> oh, he has his own room then. Well, if only Misa, Misa phone. What time did they wake up? Oh wow. It's so early and they're this loud. Oh. Okay, I'm assuming Mashiro is still sleeping. They're all they're taking over their door. <laughs> is um Shotaro able to do stuff like that now? Oh, his face. 
so intimidating. He's one hell of a... Is that how Nisapon knows him? Nisapon. Why? What's his reasons? Man, every time he's on the screen. What? We didn't get to see. We didn't get to see the actual routine. Don't be saying that. Well, they're pretty good, but it's them four. He likes his snacks, doesn't he? So these two acknowledge the hard work the three and then four had put in. Good. You shouldn't look down on them. I mean, they are a newly formed team before they operated with just four people. How did he get so mellow? Because of his wife. <laughs> That's as I said that. So is the training camp done? Or was it just for like that weekend? Yeah. Mashiro is the definition of a prodigy. Oh. going on to come to like this big realization they've been trying to accommodate with each other that it's gotten in the way of actually performing as a team no one's ever thought of our boy in that sense <laughs> even though he's been in sports for so long They hear that. <laughs> so are they like their main rivals, but also like their friends? Oh, that's right. They never actually had a welcome party, but <laughs> oh my God, he's also a big fan that's great find similarities with one another look at how straight faced exactly it is chaos oh it's a hell of a bite I just want to be their manager in Mashiro. Don't pay attention to anything besides their snack. Exactly. I've been wondering that for so long. That he wants to do.
Okay, I thought their um, training camp was already done. Oh, okay. That was a very enjoyable episode. Um, I'm glad that, you know, our team is kind of coming to their own realizations. And yeah, I guess ever since um, Mashiro, no, <laughs> ever since um, our boys, Oh my god, I don't know what I'm saying. Okay, so ever since like Shotaro and Misato officially joined the team, I guess from the perspectives of their senpais, they've been trying to accommodate for the fact that um, Mash, well, they've overall they've just been trying to accommodate for them too, and um. Also from Misato, he's also been trying to accommodate for his senpais. And of course, you know, Shotaro being a complete beginner to gymnastics, he's kind of been um, having his own difficulties of wanting to, you know, not bring the team down and wanting to improve as quickly as he could. Um, and in the end, they just weren't all sinking together and i'm you know i'm glad that they finally came to that realization in this episode and i'm also really glad that um um we had this development and for shotaro specifically it's it's wild that in all of his years playing sports, trying new things. This is really the first time where he's felt like a part of a team, which just goes to show that, um, you know, his past experiences weren't all that great for him. And I guess to finally be told that someone considers them a proper team member, but also as a rival. And, you know, they're going on this, this, of this journey together um it must feel really good for shotaro so I'm, I'm very glad for him i'm very i'm so happy for this development in our team and in our characters um i really like uh shiro, shiro the shiro team shiro high team um they're a great rival but also you know they become great friends and they they do like i like that they did that mirror reflection thing with the characters where each specific member has someone in the other team that kind of mirrors their likes and their personalities i'm glad that we get more of shiro high because we got more of mashiro so yes we are still developing the team um and probably in like the next few episodes we're gonna get to actual competition so i'm so excited for that but anyway overall very enjoyable episode. I can't wait for the next one. So until next week, bye.